Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to build a SEER model, uh, a basic one. Okay, so starting loading some libraries. <coughs> we start uh, with a um, population of 100,000, then we fix the values for uh, state variables uh, and they are our susceptibles so they uh, are um, just the, the entire population minus one um, which is the infected one because we suppose that this population starts with the one infected uh, and then uh, for the recovered we consider that we still haven't got any anyone which is uh, already recovered so this is the um, for for the for the model are the input values very important for building up the models and then we do need the parameters the parameters who are they the parameters are uh, the the factors the changing factors uh, like the beta and the beta is infection infection rate for example we have uh, um, an infection that uh, lasts for two days okay so we uh, make uh, uh, we hypothesize that we have um, two days of infection so beta uh, will be um, 0 0.5 okay then uh, the other uh, parameter is gamma in this um, in this in this case we have hypothesized that we had uh, uh, four days to recover so the gamma uh, rate will be uh, one divided by four um, the time frame The time frame will be um, so it will be a sequence um, from zero to let's say hundred days by one day. So uh, each day we we see that how it changes. Then finally we start in building up as our our model which is our seal model and how it is made the model is the a function of time state and parameters And this uh, uh, parameters uh, would be width, as list, uh, of uh, state and parameters. a yeah, list of uh, state and uh, parameters
this will be a list of a vector of state and parameters Uh, of our uh, main part, uh, which is the population and uh, how it is composed by susceptibles, infected, and recovered. And then uh, one more very important factor, which is lambda. Um, and lambda is our force of infection. our force of infection and how it is made lambda is made by beta times the proportion of infected in the population and then finally our differential equations which are the variation of the uh, susceptibles and uh, it is given by uh, so they are decreasing in time as the infection decreases made by lambda times the susceptibles and then the uh, variation of the infected uh, is by lambda times the susceptibles the end it uh, they decreases they decrease by gamma times the infected the gamma is the recovery rate so uh, the infected uh, they decrease it by the number of, of recovered okay and the vari as, con con uh, as a consequence the variation of recovered is given by the uh, rate of recovered uh, times the infected. So uh, now we need to def the function to return the list of the vector uh, of the susceptibles, the infected, and the recovered. Okay, so this is. Um, all we need is this okay 